Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, we are actually going to be detailing the interior of the new to us 2007 Lincoln Navigator we just bought. We bought this car because we really needed some space for not just our family, we needed a hauler so that my husband's Dodge truck wasn't doing all the hauling, as well as my daughter got a new German short hair pointer puppy named River. He's going to now be joining us on a lot of our adventures, and so we definitely needed a SUV that was able to hold our two daughters and these two dogs that are going to both be large. Cooper is already an 80 pound dog and River is probably on track to be similar. So we got this car in very nice condition from the original owner. The car has just the atypical buildup of raising kids in an SUV, traveling in an SUV, them having their pet in the SUV, and it just needs a good overhaul and cleaning so that we're happy with it and we're able to make it ours. Um, the steering wheel is extremely sticky right now, as well as the floors, the mats are obviously from 2007, so they're pretty worn, and the carpet and mats are pretty stained. The seats all need a pretty good scrub down, and then they're going to need to be leather cared and conditioned. I think to start with, I just want to get the car vacuumed out, get it all wiped down, kind of degreased with some simple green and from there go ahead and do the steam cleaning come back maybe in another day to do the leather care the car had a bench seat for the second row we removed the middle seat because we ordered a center console and are going to change it into more like the captain's chairs model where you have the two chairs and a center console with extra cup holders and storage in the middle that works really well for our family so we have that cup holder center console on the way. We also have a bunch of all weather floor mats for it coming so that once we do all this work, we're able to save the work and keep the car maintained this way until we decide to sell it. So without further ado, let's hop into it. I've got a lot of work ahead of me. My 10 year old daughter is actually gonna help me with this today too. It's gonna end up probably being about a two day project. It's a very big car and we have a lot to cover. So let's get started.